Okay, this is Killian, and Killian is a Shih Tzu Bichon mix. Um, as you can probably tell, I've already done the rest of him. And I'm waiting to do his face because I wanted to show you guys, um, you know, if you have a dog at home, basically Killian represents every uh, Shih Tzu mix, every dog with a short face that can't see by the end of its grooming time. Um, and I'm going to show you how to just trim that up at home, and then um, his owners like his face pretty short, so... I'll finish him up with that and then you guys can see the end result. So I really hope you guys can see this because I only have one hand. But basically all you need is a comb and a set of shears. And um, you can just get a set of shears at Sally Beauty. Um, they don't have to be anything special if this is going to be the extent of your home grooming. Um, and basically what you want to do is you just want to come in comb everything forward. Obviously, you probably can't see a whole lot here. And you just want to come in, basically, you want to feel where the where the stop in the nose is. You just want to come in straight and just take a chunk. And that's going to basically tell you where that line is going to be. And you can just kind of keep combing around with it, feeling around, you know, seeing where it ends up for you. Once you get a good brow length that you like, just take and comb it back. Well, you can see you still got this stuff in the corner here. So what we'll do, take the end of your shears, it's going to come right in and snip it out. Very simple. down. You always want to cut with the lay of the hair when you're doing it up here, otherwise it's going to end up very blunt. Basically, you just take little snips. Some dogs will allow you to do this, some won't. You just want to take little snips until you get what you like. Got a little tough up here on the top, so I'm just going to take in and come around like that. And now he can see. If you want to go shorter, you can brush it back like this. You can get his eyelashes so they're out of the way. And basically, that's all there is to it. If you're wanting to trim around the muzzle, you know, it's getting too long down here for you. You've trimmed around the eyes, feeling pretty confident. Just take the ear, fold it up, and he's still a little wet, but he's not bad. Make sure you get all the snarls out. I'm going to take that out with the clippers later. Basically, you can kind of see where I've gone before. There's a little line here. I'm just going to take my scissors and follow that line. Very easy. And you just keep going around and you get the other side. Basically, that is all there is to it. Okay, I'm going to finish him up um, the way his owners like. And um, I'll take a picture and there you have it. Easy peasy.